When the school was originally built over 40 years ago, the ideas of the technologies and the collaborative interaction in public affairs weren't as well developed as they are now. So the school used this $19 million from the University of Texas at Austin to really develop the LBJ School into a structure that was a lot more inviting, provided a lot more collaboration, and took advantage of the information and, and computer technologies that have grown over the past two decades. And we've created a school now uh, that allows for a lot of interaction and a lot of collaboration on the behalf of uh, students, faculty, and staff. It's, uh, you know, open, it's good, we finally have all our space back. It's a lot more conducive to working than the previous building was. There's a lot of computers in there, I think. No, nobody ever has to wait for a computer. A lot of them are GIS equipped, which is absolutely necessary for some of the students. The computer lab is excellent because people in the PRP and I like being here rather than having to walk to the architecture school. So that is a bonus. The renovations at the LBJ School really it set us on a course to being one of the most innovative and uh, cutting edge public affairs schools in, in the nation or the world. We've tripled the amount of uh, classroom space, we've taken advantage of a whole range of new cutting edge technologies and really set up the stage for us to, to be the leaders in public affairs education going well into the next century. It's fantastic. Um, every, the, all the open spaces and the modern looking decor. The openness, like before, uh, I remember like the classes, it was kind of like hallways, but the classes had windows, but like there were no, win like there didn't seem to be too many windows in the building, but now it's like when you come in, it's just everything's open, you can see a lot more appealing and a lot more natural light, and I don't know, it just makes it more fun to kind of work in the building, I guess. The intention was to open up the school uh, to allow for a lot more interaction and collaboration amongst faculty, staff, and students. If you take a tour of the building, you can see how that really has come into play. There's a lot more openness, and it's allowed us to use technologies so that we're not only communicating internally here at the school or with our colleagues across campus, but we're able to reach out to people across the world.